Hello everybody and welcome back to the Invincible and we are indeed back. Now, uh, where did we leave off? Let's continue and find out. Ah, yes, that's it, yes. So, Yasna, our character, uh, yeah, she got captured, didn't she, by um, one of the Alliance members. Survivor, with minimal beardage, and two others who have succumbed to the stupor. Uh, due to the uh, the fruit flies, the metallic fruit flies coming off the metal bushes, causing uh, electromagnetic inf interferences, which fiddle with our brains and uh, make them go absolutely mad. Um, so, yes, um, fortunately, as we can see here from the reading, <coughs> he has to provide Rohitra provokes. Sorry. Uh, to talk to her, but she fails to convince him of her innocence. Yes. Yes, she remains as distrustful and vigilant. Now, as with the uh, comic strips that get updated throughout the game, I am going to leave them to uh, the end of the episode, as opposed to sort of pausing as they come. Because um, we're going to leave this... Um, flowing naturally as a story uh, as intended so if I now remember correctly uh, we left off where Rahitra was sleeping we're still guarded by this robot and we need to uh, escape or find means of escape and or communication um, without uh, without them knowing yeah so let's press any button still don't know where that is Finish the conversation. I think we did. Yes. Oh, but... My neck. Right. Well, we can move. Uh, how far can we move? You Not... don't know the concept of weariness, do you? <laughs> no. Just standing there. Oh, wait. Hang on. Uh, could I have selected something there? Or was that just a glitch? Okay, the only thing I can do here is pick up a rock. Now, where do I throw it? I could throw it down there, but I did that already. Could try and wake this guy up. Hmm. Trouble is, I don't want to wake Rahitra up. Let's just try throwing it down there and see what happens. I'll turn. Check that noise. Oh, nothing. Now, was that my only shot at that? Or was I supposed to do that? Because these things are still selectable. That's interesting. Okay, let's go there. Oh, no, I'm still throwing stones. Right. Oh, okay. Still nothing. Ah, okay, so I, I haven't just picked up one. I picked up enough to cause a disturbance. Is there anything else I can do? I'd rather not wake this guy up because... You might wake Rahitra. I don't think I've got a choice. It's Blue's curse. Psst. Priority zero. Man in danger. Bingo. Okay, didn't wake Rahitra up. Unless he's suddenly died. Very doubtful. Very doubtful indeed. Oh, now I can move. Shit. Um, oh, I've saved. Attention. Man in danger. Some kind of sedative for calming his comrades? Or is he trouble falling asleep? It's broken. What a perfidious prick. Can I crouch? No. It's high time to get out of here. I think so. Well, here's... <sighs> yeah, look. That's stuck on base too. Okay, I'm out of here. Bollocks of this. It's going to see me, isn't it? No. Well, they did say sneak. Okay. I love the uh, love the music on this. There's nothing over there, is it? No. Oh. That looks like a problem. Phew. It worked. Um. Ah, that's better. Yeah, sorry about that. The game d d decided not to load. It worked. Um, 
I think we're okay. We'll better that out. I, I escaped. Oh, hang on. No, he's taking your... Novik? He's taking your doodar off. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. Astrogator, are you there? I escaped him. Doctor, what a relief. Oh. Where exactly are you? No, I didn't fully I'm take the wire hideout. off. Ah. Though I intend to change that as soon as possible. There. Have you met Spluskus and Lendl? Yet. How do you know their names? I've intercepted the Alliance's communications. Keep going. We'll discuss everything on the way. The path along the cliff looks much hmm. safer. I think I can get down here. How Good. did he know? Proceed. Ah, uh, damn. Can I not go back down to the base? Oh, all the lights are on. Okay. Yasna, I have to ask. Yeah. What happened in the last few hours? <coughs> that man... He didn't hurt you, did he? Uh, well, I spoke to him. I talked to Rahitra for quite some time. Then he had an Octang guard me, but its algorithms proved easy to trick. What do you make of this man? Lovely what again. kind of person is he? He's a distrustful type. Rough around the edges. It was impossible to get along with him. Then we need a new plan. Uh, yeah. Seems so. Although I could use some rest. Mm. Uh, it was a rough day. A night. Yeah. A rough couple of days, actually. Wow. Sorry, Doctor, but you'll have to get away from there first. Mm. Shouldn't be a problem. <clears throat> now, well, it looks like I'm not going back to the Alliance base, which is a bit of a problem because... I think in the last video when I discovered the hideout, I could have gone back to the hideout, uh, back to the base, sorry, and retrieved some additional information from the Alliance probe um, that we discovered. But I missed that. There was something else that I missed as well, and I can't remember what it was. So there was information there, and I'm annoyed that I missed that. But unfortunately, we have to move on. <laughs> right, where are we? Oh, something there. <clears throat> Hopefully, we're going to find a way off this planet. I think I know where to go. There's a hole from an antimatter beam on the other side of the canyon. Very well. Perhaps you can find out where the invincible lamp did. Oh, I didn't tell you the most important thing. Condor's here, on this planet. Condor? Yes. Looks like HQ got it all mixed up. Both the arrival time and the ship itself. What? That's unbelievable. How could the intelligence be so wrong? As soon as we return, I'll break their... Never mind. <laughs> um, if the Condor's here... There's got to be people. If it's has already been described as a very big ship... But not as big as the Invincible, I think, if I got that right. So either way, we're going to find people. But I think that's a priority. I think I'll follow Milos. The one who transported remaining survivors. Not to Condor. He was heading there anyway. Maybe I can join his group. If they're still alive. Given the circumstances, that's quite unlikely. Mm. I know. But since I managed to find three living people... All right. We'll do as you say, Doctor. I trust your judgment. Follow the route Milos took to the Condor. So, I think either way, it looks like the, inevitab the inevitability is that we are, we are going to the Condor. I need to get down. But I'm not going down this way. So, I have to find another route. Sorry, Passage. This is lovely at night. Clear. No uh, light pollution. There's an underground tunnel in front of me. We may cut out for a moment. Understood. Oh, this looks like a slide down. <gasps> oh. 
I really did think I was going to slide longer. Can you hear me? You're cutting out a bit, but it's not that bad. Okay. I'd love to one day ex explore. Well, probably not in my time, but explore planets like this. Maybe even, you know, head to the moon or even Mars. They colonize it. Again, probably not within my time. Unless, um, Mr. Musk has uh, any ideas. Or even Branson, for that matter. Right. Ah, there's a rover there. So you could quite easily sleep here, couldn't you? You could just set up camp inside here and you'd be. Yes. Great. Hitcher has a rover. Do you mean half doctor? Oh. Well, well. You've never made jokes like that before, sir. <laughs> it's mine now. I'm just glad you're fine. Come on, game load. And then I'll rob that alliance prick, huh? Maybe. Struggling. A little. Cool. Right. Let's go. To get to the end of this insane story. Keep following the road to Condor. Sugar. Okay, where was that hole? Let's see the pressure. Um. Uh, ooh, hang on. Ah, there it is. Okay. Where was that probe as well? I'm wondering, what is Condor doing here? I have no idea. Rahitra didn't tell me anything about it. I reckon he could have. Uh, definitely could have convinced him, I think. And I think he, he could have told us more had, you know, gone down that route. Telling him that we're here to find flora and fauna. But we didn't know about the Alliance really in their involvement up until really that point. So, but he was not convinced. Oh, I can't see what I'm doing. I don't think there's anything off to my right, so just keep following the tunnel. Created by an antimatter weapon. Oh, oh, uh, okay, everything's loading in. Um, I thought there was a secret there. Skip everything. Game ends. Credits! No. Just keep following around. It is difficult to see, though, sometimes, I think. I love the game, but it's a bit janky when it's trying to load in sort of anything from the outside of the game. You know, if you're outside opposed to inside, like let's say a building, for example. The frame rate changes as well. I think that's probably again down to a bit of a loading issue. Ooh. Is it? No, okay. I've driven to the place where they were stationed before they set up the base. Do you want to stop? Mm. Um. Alright, we need information. Okay. Maybe I'll find something worthwhile. Cool, okay. Ooh. There's several artisans here. Are they still working? Yes. I wonder for how long. Can I interact? Hello. Okay. What are you doing? Are you offline or online? Oh, dead man. Sometimes I think we don't stand a chance. What are you talking about? About us, Astrogator. Humans. 
biological organisms. All this so-called life is so fragile compares to the lifelessness of machines. So you found more bodies? One. Is it Milos? No. Someone else. Oh, you can't help him anymore. But there are still people who are alive and need you. Let's not forget about them. As you said yourself, Doctor. Please keep going. Also to note, um, part four of this series was missing from the playlist. I thought I hadn't uploaded it. Just turns out I didn't actually put it in the playlist, so it should be there now. Um, and also it shouldn't be unlisted anymore. Using an open Bring channel to your cast. Over. How's it going? Are you no receiving this, so Astrogator? Affirmative. Milos, what do you think? What's going to happen now? I have no idea. I've never seen anything like this before. Perhaps the higher-ups can do something. Hey! Hey, Morrow! Sit down! Uh, I wish we had secured them better. But back to the matter. Have you found anyone else? One working art can so far. Several probes also seem to... People, Rehitra. Only people matter. I know. The art can will help me look for them. I'm going away for a while. I stopped at the old excavations. I'll look for pet stars. All right. I'll check the base again. Oh. Over and out. It was, it, was, it was broken. I'm moving on. About pet stars. Okay. There's nothing we can do for him anymore. are here. I have one of them, a woman. Ah. She was talking to someone on the radio, but I didn't see anyone around him. I've already broadcast to the base. Let's come back soon. I'm closing the channel. Talk to you later. Okay, I think that's enough sightseeing for me. If Milos kept going, so should I. Agreed. So they've been in contact with each other. So they, they definitely know that I'm here now. A hundred percent. I don't think then I can access these other units here. And also I think... Oh, maybe this one? The light's on there. I think that robot there was a, in a bit of a glitch. So it was stuck there and it took one Artem to um, <laughs> edit out of its... Uh, loop as it were. Although actually Oh no. No, that's tire tracks. Oh no. Never mind. I wonder if it's realized then that that robot's in a bit of peril, but then it's a continuous loop, so maybe it's deliberate. So I think to keep following this track. I need to go, uh, I need to reverse and go my left. Okay, nothing on radar, so that's fine. Ah. I can check the journal here, where am I going? So I need to go... Okay, so there's nothing to my right. Oh, this fi ah, so field base 2. Right, okay. So that's that's the base we've gone past, and that's the, the base that... Uh, the first base we went to is in connection with. Okay. So we've got to follow the transport. That's fine. Okay, let's keep to the map here. Don't think there's any, anything else to our left. So I think it circles around. So we've got to go this way. Uh, there's a problem. I'm listening. The route they took is blocked by a force field. There must be an Energobot somewhere. But I don't know if I can get to it. Maybe you can go around the field. I'll check. Although. 
Although... Uh. Don't know how it spins me around like that. It's pretty narrow here. The route is blocked all the way across. Boulders are blocking the way. So even if I turn the force field off, we still can't proceed. Even if I find a way, I'll have to continue without the rover. Uh, wouldn't make much sense. Please keep looking. The transporter. They're here. It's standing still. In front of the force field. Is that Milos, convoy? I'll confirm soon, but yes, most likely. There's someone inside. More than one. Two. And they're all in the transporter? Ready yourself for the worst, Doctor. I am. Ready. Multiple contacts. Tons of them. Not tons, but... Get the idea. I'm going in. <sighs> well, actually... <clears throat> I'm squeezing in. Still, no one here. Oh, they must be in the back. Hang on. Moment of truth. Oh, shit. Have I done something before I was supposed to do something? It's on. Oh. No, Did this... the door open? Not exactly. The inner door is still locked, and the outer door is just shut. I repeat, now all doors have. Wait! Whoa! The back door open. Ah, <laughs> uh, don't. Oh my. Don't blink out. No. What? This what vehicle. Is it's a coffin, sir. Mass grave. They were all crammed in here. In the heat and darkness. With no chance of understanding what's going on. Terrible death. I'm sorry you have to see that. The number of registers, 428. Playing in broadcast mode. You found more of those? No. It started automatically. Hello, Condor. This is Rohitra speaking. It's day 26, time 805. I'm continuing my search for the missing crew. I checked the excavation area. I've yet to find others. Come here as soon as possible. We need backup. Over and out. Oh dear. Hello, Condor. This is Rohit for speaking. Uh. It's day 26. Time is 8.05. I'm still searching for the missing. Are you hearing this, sir? I've checked the excavation area, but... He's repeating himself. There's no one else. We need help. The recordings... They're slightly Please. different. Over and out. Hello. Condor, this is Rohitra speaking. It's day 26, time 806. So I've like returned that. from that the excavation site. I was looking for others. recordings might have the same content. They were no longer He's there. Been here for far I'll too continue long. my search. Far we too long not to receive help support. from Condor. Damn. Come back, right? Over Nobody now. will come. Hello. I'm afraid there's not a soul this here on this damned it's planet, day 26, except for the three in the cave. Yes, I have a request. I've uh, returned listening. from Let's the skip this to the rest of the recording. I was looking for others, but no way. They were I'm not no going back there. there. I'll continue my search. We're Let's waiting change the time. Your support. Why not jump? That I can do. Come back. All right. <laughs> Talk to you in a second. Now. Ah. ah. Okay. Much better. So I didn't need to go Agreed. back. No survivors, but our track. What the hell was that? Astrogator, someone's firing distress flares from near the hideout. Do you think it's Rohitra? Uh. Who else could it be? Did he realize I ran away? No. He broadcast a radio message, but didn't say a word about you. Uh, as duh. if nothing had happened. Oh. It means he just started a new cycle. Please be more clear. He fell asleep and forgot what happened the whole day. And once again, he will wake up on the 26th day of the mission. I almost feel sorry for him. Don't joke about it. If I don't snap him out of this cycle, he'll keep repeating it until he dies. Or goes insane. Of course, I feel the tragedy of this man. You want to rescue him, even though he's still a threat. You don't have to say anything. Hmm. So, his mind has been affected by the cloud, and I think 
my mind has as well. Just a little bit. Because we blacked out before we've gone back to where we fell after trying to climb up the wall and grab me hold of one of those metal bushes. To leverage yourself up. I see the hill. I'll be there in a minute. Please slow down. Remember he has a gun. He didn't shoot at you the first time, but if you go in now... He won't this time as well. In any case, let's not worry in advance. I haven't located him yet. What about all those machines on the hill? Is there anything there he could use to threaten you? Your reaction to your late night visit? Well, let's see. Given you're bringing him such devastating news, you might overreact. Oh, no, can't go that way. Um, <laughs> straight off a cliff. Alright, it wants me to get out. Full arsenal. It's safe. Where is it safe? We don't know. He can literally erase me from this planet if he wanted to. I know it's at stake. I can handle it. Ah, so there used to be a shield here, but that's gone down. All right, Rahitra. Where are you hiding? Has he already left? Don't you see him? I don't. But he's here. Now oh, this looks like something from Star Wars. Okay, is there anybody in there? Can I explore this? No. Ah, stop. Oh! I run out of stamina as well. Okay. Alright, so he's in there. Oh! Hey, there he is. Who the hell are you? Oh, here we go again. What are you doing here? Good luck, Doctor. Uh, take it easy, Rahitra. What? How do you... Uh, I'll tell you everything. Just shut up for a moment and listen. I will not. Rahitra, for fuck's sake. Do it for Spluskas and Lendor. You're not beating around the bush, Doctor. You think <laughs> it's a 26th day of the mission? Just after the attack on your base that left many of you in critical condition. But the truth is much worse. Milos left a long time ago. What? H how do you... You fell victim to that attack as well. The microbot cloud has wiped all traces of your comrades' memories. Oh your long-term memory is probably fine. That is, up until the moment you found them. You keep forgetting everything that comes after. I have reason to believe it happens during sleep. As a result, you relive the same day over and over, waiting for backup that will never arrive. The micro what cloud? That's bullshit. <laughs> I don't know what you're trying to achieve, but focus, Rahitra. We've already met oh, once. Shit. We spoke in your hideout. You've had me at gunpoint already. Look at yourself. Look at Spluskus and Lendor. Did you all have beards yesterday? Don't mess with my head. Milos will come. Milos is dead. They're all dead. They've been lying nearby for hundreds of days. You were supposed to go and check why contact was lost. You were supposed to leave tomorrow. But tomorrow never comes. Hmm. Stop it! I know that it's hard for you to believe. I'm not against you. I would I came expect back more emotion from you. Me, but... No, I'm warning you. Oh. I'll use my gun. Rahitra. <laughs> I know you won't shoot me. Certain? Uh, thanks. <laughs> Fuck! Quick, get it! Long? Oh, wait, no, How I can move. I Good. You're finally getting to him. 428 days. At least that's how many times you've broadcast your morning message to Milos. This, this, this cloud? A result of the evolution of inorganic beings. It, it attacks the most important parts of biological organisms. 
our brains. It responds to radio waves. That's how it found our crew. Damn it. Every time I broadcast, there's a wave bombarding all devices. This electromagnetic field. The cloud produced it. Doctor. That's right. This is how it damages our brains. Our robots and, and all machinery. Hey, to interrupt, but we have a problem. The cloud is coming. Right now? Yes. It's closing in on you. Oh, How shit. You Copy that. Uh, what's going on? Um, Who are you talking to? Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, never mind about that. This is a topic for another time. The cloud will be here soon. Quick, lead to the hideout. Oh, yeah. Now, move! Can he get through the force field? Hey, hey! What are you trying to do? I'm done waiting. There's no need to anymore. There's no one left to look for. All that's left is revenge. Astrogator, I think he wants to fight. What a fool. Can't you stop him somehow? He'll cause trouble for both of you. I don't think so. He's already opened the field. I see. You can't beat him, join him. Damn. You have a much better chance of survival if you stick together. Hey! Uh, you. What's your name, anyway? Yasna. I'm... Um... Ah, uh, whatever. You know already. Huh. Yes. Yeah, um. What's this? Are you familiar with the energy transformation of Dirac emitters? Uh. No. Uh, Thought so. The emitters energy system is not Here, take it. You can help. By shooting. I'll take care of maintaining the force field. Um. When you aim, wait for the green light. Then you can take the shot. The device is connected to three combat machines. Okay. It sounds simple. Yeah. All right, where's, where's this cloud thing? Check, check. Hey, over. Let's stay in touch. Copy oh, I, oh, okay. Oh. I don't see it. Soon it'll be within range of the guns. It's coming from the east, over the hill. Well, it went green. Uh, affirmative. I see it. Oh shit. Oh shit. Um. Uh. Breaking them? I don't know. Power sixty percent. What? Why not a hundred? Fire. We don't want to go full power again. Damned flies. What? Later, Rahitra. Later. Damn. I don't know. I'm not that quick at this. Oh god, what am I doing? Why? What is? I got some. Did I help? Okay, well that's green. I'm just gonna fire because it said fire at green. Oh god, did they break through? I don't know if I could have stopped that. I really don't. Damn. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Don't you give up now. You wanted this fight. 
So fight! There's no green to hit. That was sort of two lights of green and one red. Maybe that was wrong. The field keeps shrinking. Do something about it, will you? Rahitra, are you there? What's going on with you? Fuck. There's no green. Frick, where is he? He's over here. You've got to be kidding! Oh, he's gone. Rahitra, you coward! Where are you? Say something! What, the cloud is too scary for you after all? Come back here and fight! Maybe that's what I'm supposed to Maybe that's what I'm supposed to be doing. Maybe it doesn't matter if the lights are not on full green. Maybe it's if I get it on like a couple of lights green or one light green. Uh, we're not doing very well here. I don't think. I can't move. I am moving. Am I moving? I'm moving. ship to have survived. Do you? I'm not that naive. I need the condor itself. Mm. In order to... Have the entire arsenal of our flagship at our disposal. We might be losing now, but it doesn't mean we can give up. How do I... We'll send the Cyclops out to fight. Cyclops? That's a code name for... It's more of a moniker. For an 80-ton machine with firepower exceeding all intimates combined. Usually use it in conditions of high radiation, contamination. Yeah, I'd imagine I'd get in from the other side. Due to the interference of the force field, it floats several feet above ah. the ground. So it doesn't depend on the surface. In addition to the Dirac's force field, it has an antimatter spherical blaster. Well, I hope you're right. Come again? Because I've heard about your power more than once. Ah. And all I see is one defeat after another. In this case, Yasna, it's not just empty boasting. Sending the Cyclops somewhere is... is like giving the task to the devil himself. Look, I've given you a simple choice, Yasta. Are you going or not? Go where there could be water, medicine, resources, or stay here to die. Uh, I, wow. I, th I, th I think Such the choice is to leave. I hope I won't regret it. Too bad you didn't mention earlier that you had a working saucer. We could fly to Kondo right away. Or even into orbit. Working is a big word. It's just a tin can with a couple of sputtering engines. <laughs> Controlling it technically doesn't work. I'm staying. Somehow it does not surprise me. Let's fly. Just a minute. So I could have stayed. For the force field to shut down, which should be soon. And away we go. We left rather quickly. Um. No, no, ouch. Oh. Hold on, was it? Where the devil are we? Can I... Can I leave? Hello? He's not here. Rehitra? He took his men to the ship. They're inside now. 
How do you know all this? Well, I heard him talking to them. To you. <sighs> Didn't he notice I wasn't responding? Yes, he did. He said he'd be back. Interesting. If he expected me to wait here, he's sorely mistaken. No, 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 no. Wow. <sighs> it's impressive. The Condor? Yes. Uh, it looked majestic in the pictures. In real life, too. I think I know where a hitcher is. Inside? It's to be expected that we'll lose communications as soon as you enter the cargo bay. Sure thing. So many tons of steel. Indeed. You'll have to establish a connection using one of the devices on the ship. I'm sure you'll find one in the command bridge. No, we need to... I'll find that radio. No we worries. We need communication. Need to keep in contact with uh, Novik. That's their marvel of military technology. Ritual wastes no time. Is it attacking already? For now, he's only released the Cyclops, as they call it. The hell is he think? <laughs> it's floating majestically, three meters above the ground. Ah, what does it look like? Must admit that I haven't seen any pictures of the Cyclops. The Alliance it's... tried to keep its existence a secret. So there are a lot of unsubstantiated legends about it. From a machine of destruction. Quite inconspicuous, I'd say. Sort of like a massive, heavily armed spinning top. Spinning top? Oh, that's unexpected. <laughs> if only we could get hold of its blueprints. This is hardly the time, Astrogator. Yes, yes. Another time. <sighs> I need to focus on finding Rahitra. Suppress his warlike tendencies. <laughs> I think Novak wants more out of this. It seems to it's be. One more thing, Yasta. This is important. I'll be able to confirm it in a while, but so far everything indicates. What is that, Astrogator? Headquarters were right about the Invincible. It's actually flying here. If I'm reading the message correctly, they'll be here in a few days. They're looking for the missing Condor. And they have no idea of the danger. I'm going to go with the middle option So here. our mission made no sense from the start. We wanted to outplay the Alliance. But uh, instead, so we, we got that. ourselves into the same trouble. We still don't know everything. But yes, they're on a rescue mission. Shit, that looks open. Oh, damn, but I'm all the way up here. Hang on. You can see everything from up here. Oh, by the way, that turned out to be nothing. I'm entering the cargo hold. Oh, shut up. We're inside Condor. Okay. Let's have a look inside this beast. It's extensive. And also... We've come to a natural save, which means, ladies and gentlemen, that we shall be exploring the Condor in the next episode. <sighs> Nail-biting stuff. And lots and lots of discoveries. And we found Rahitra again, stuck in his cycle, sending the same message out for hundreds and hundreds of days. Four, over 400, uh, to be in fact. So... Cloud of flies have clouded his mind. <clears throat> Sent him on a continuous cycle over and over again. That's affected Yasna as well. But Milos... Uh, I'm not sure if he survived. Uh, managed to get back to Condor. I don't think so, because there was a lot of unfortunateness of dead bodies in one of the other transports that we discovered. Hoping that there would be signs of life, but unfortunately there isn't, or wasn't. So, the next phase of our mission is exploring the Condor. We need to A, find Rahitra, and B, find a radio. I have, it looks as if I've gone with a radio option. Makes sense, keeping 
contact with uh, Novik on the Dragonfly. Also, <clears throat> like I said, actually, I missed. Let's go back because we've got uh, more parts of the comic book to find here. While escaping, Yasna is knocked unconscious. But memories of her first encounter with the cloud come back to her. Yasna notices silhouettes of living people near the balloon. Even though Novik doesn't believe her, Yasna goes there. After analysing the balloon logs, Yasna confirms the presence of humans in the area. She also discovers the potential location of their hideout. Thus, Yasna meets an armed man who takes her prisoner. Stranger leads Yasna to his hideout where she meets two other men in a state of deep stupor. Both fell fit into the cloud. She provokes Rahitra to talk to her, but she fails to convince him of her innocence. She remains he remains distrustful and vigilant. So Yasna manages to sneak out of the Alliance's hideout and follows the route to the condor. So this is where we are up to now. Yesna finds the evacuation transporter with remaining survivors, all dead after they failed to reach the Condor. It appears that Rahitra is waiting for help that will never come, hence transport for the people. But never came to his help. Yesna returns to Rahitra, who no longer remembers her. This time, however, she she's able to persuade him and proves that no one will come to their rescue. Deeply shaken, Rahitra provokes a fight with the cloud. Rahitra and Yasna fight the cloud using a force field and antimatter cannons. Despite many losses, cloud manages to break through the field, so they are forced to flee in a damaged saucer. Saucer crashes near the condor, and Yazda is knocked unconscious. After waking up, a scientist discovers that she is alone. Hmm. So, say again, our aim is to find Rahitra. But for this particular video and episode, we are at the end, unfortunately. So, if you enjoy what you see, if you like and everything, do leave a like, subscribe, comment, share the video. Uh, and that will do it. So thank you once again, past, present and future watchers for watching. Cheerio.